What is it like when you get that script? Do you get a phone call from the producers? Like, you're not really, really dying. You're just dying for like three weeks. Right. Okay. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the day, the day that that script came out, um, where I was, where I was dead. Um, I had a bunch of lines that day, so I wasn't. I, I hadn't read the next episode yet, and everyone's coming up to me on set, a bunch of the crew, and everyone's saying, "Did you read the next episode?" I'm like, <laughs> "No, what happens?" And there's like, "Oh, oh, you should read it." <laughs> it's like, I was like, "Well, thanks." So I do that multiple times. I get literally that exact same answer, and uh, finally, I'm just like, "Okay, I'm gonna play along," and I, I, I get the same question. I go, "Yeah, I can't believe it. Like, come on." And then they're like, "Yeah, like, what's up with you dying?" And I go, "What?" <laughs> <laughs> automatically like freak out. I'm like looking at everyone is like, why does everyone know this and everyone is fine? Julie later I get an email and she's like, forgot to tell you, you, you do come back. And I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> so, you read the script, it's okay, don't yeah. be scared. <laughs> so that was, that was how I found out I died. I feel, I feel like you probably have to issue a lot of those warnings between these two shows. Yeah, and when you do forget, it's really <laughs> awkward. <laughs> Yes, we do. We have a rule. It's like if, if you're killing off a series regular, you you, you know you got to tell them in person. If you're if you're killing off a you know a person temporarily, you got to warn them before the script comes out. <laughs> um, and uh, and you know every now and then things slip through the cracks. <laughs> <laughs> So now when we say, hey, we'd like to see you, come on into our office. You don't Shut go the in their door. office. Yeah. <laughs> Never go in their office. Don't, don't go in their office. the other way. <laughs> um, but Daniel, I'm curious, because Davina is a pretty fantastic character. Yeah. I, I, the, I mean, I was so excited when she got out of the attic and when she really got to like start living <laughs> her life. I mean, what excited you about the journey you got to take, you know, up until her death or since her resurrection? Well, you know, you were asking everyone about like their special talents and what I was getting is like, are you, can you throw people into a wall? Can you, can you ex make explosions happen? And Levitate. you know, I, I, I <laughs> um, but no, I, I love it. I mean, getting to play a witch is awesome and then as powerful as they made her, it's just like, it's, it's amazing. I've been really lucky. <laughs> Aww. This is fantastic. I mean, it, it had to be pretty cool. Like, I mean, it, there's acting and there's being professional, but when you're playing a scene where you basically lose, use your mind powers to levitate four witches and snap their necks in the middle of a church. That was so 